good day next we'll be looking at the principle of uh, maximum potential energy so suppose if we have an object in which main loads are acting like p1 p2 p3 pn and corresponding to these loads we have displacements as we have shown here delta 1 delta 2 that time so uh, we know that uh, work done is equal to force and displacement p delta so the net work done is given by force and the corresponding displacement and the energy that's if the load is entirely applied is given by v is equal to half into room displacement so suppose that we are applying or we are considering a virtual displacement delta 1 delta 2 etc delta n for each load then the change in energy is given by delta u and the total energy is and total energy is given by u plus delta e or the final energy is given by u plus delta e where delta e is equal to load that is p into delta delta so again uh, as i said in the uh, maxwell's reciprocal theorem we don't have a half here so the total energy is given by this thing where u is this half and delta n is this half suppose that we consider delta u alone this is delta u and suppose that we are uh, uh, summing up the total forces or we are considering um, a, a, something like a complementary strain energy that is delta p delta along with this so here delta p is zero as we are we are not applying any virtual forces so delta p is zero so the whole thing is uh, zero we are just adding zero to this thing this is just to get into a theory so here uh, we can pull out the delta pull the delta out that is we can write something like uh, delta okay, delta p of delta equal to something like delta p plus something like the differential differential formula so if we can um, think of the reverse of this we will get u is equal to delta u is equal to delta of this term uh, so we can see that inside the bracket we have the work done so delta u is equal to delta w that is the change in internal energy is equal to the change in work done so again um, pulling out delta you will get delta u minus w is equal to zero or u minus w term is called as the total potential energy so this is the total potential energy so uh, we have seen that, that for the total potential energy the change in potential energy the change in total potential energy should be zero or um, if you divide it by uh, the displacement that is as i have shown here and take the limits if the displacement tends to uh, become zero then we have the partial differential of the total potential energy with respect to the partial differential of different uh, the displacement is equal to zero i'll come to that uh, what this means so uh, again for stable equilibrium and this should be the condition that is uh, this total uh, potential energy should be minimum or uh, the second derivative of total potential energy should be minimum what this means is that for any given displacement the potential energy should have the least value so this condition is for maximum or minimum and this condition is for minimum so this states that for a given state or if we have a given load and corresponding to a load we have a displacement 
the displacement will be in such a way that the total energy or the total potential energy of the system is minimum. So this condition that is do phi by do delta n is equal to zero will give us or will um, allow us to assess what the minimum condition is and at that particular condition this should be uh, the second derivative should be uh, less than zero sorry less than zero for phi to be minimum okay so that's what mm, the principle of minimum potential energy says or the minimum principle of minimum total potential energy says so in theory or uh, the definition of minimum potential energy is that the principle of minimum potential energy states that the equilibrium displacement for an elastic body under action of a load or system of loads will be the one having the minimum total potential energy and the minimum and uh, the total potential energy is defined as it is equal to the difference in strain energy u and the network w Okay. I hope you can understand, understood this thing. Eh?